I'm running the debate channel in uh, the Pangburn uh, Philosophy Discord this evening. How are you? Uh, I'm all right. What's mm. um? How's it going? What's going on? Not much. Where Travis at? Uh, I don't know. It's, um, he's not here. It's possible he's just asleep or out doing something. Maybe. So. <clears throat> Uh, you're live on my channel. Uh, if, 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 you know, if, if that's not something you want, I'd be okay if you ducked out. No, no, that's cool. Uh, what's your channel? Uh, we're Echoplex Media, but tonight we do a show called The Intellectual Dollar Tree. Okay. If you could imagine, uh, could you imagine maybe what we talk about on this show? Uh, not particularly that. I mean, intellectual dollar tree. I would, I would imagine that's a, a reference to the intellectual dark web. That's, that's absolutely correct. <clears throat> so uh, we came across Travis a long time ago when he was hosting debates between like uh, Beef and Benzo's Jordy Pete and uh, like Matt Dillahunty. But we, we saw an episode the other night where he was talking to uh, Stephen, uh, Stephen Destiny. Mm -hmm. and then we saw a, a video that he had done afterwards where he said a bunch of mean shit about uh, Stephen Destiny, right? Mm -hmm. And we were just wondering why he, and maybe you don't know, and you're just some, you, you just showed up in the, the voice channel, which I appreciate, but uh, we just wondered why he hadn't made any of those negative comments to Stephen Destiny, who was on his show when Stephen Destiny was on his show. I mean, I can't really speak for Travis with, um, no, no, I'm not asking that. That's just like why we ended up in this discord channel. I certainly like yeah. pe people in my discord would stick up for me and stuff, but like, I don't think that it's important that you do that. I was just wondering. No, like, I mean, I don't like, I, I, I can't, I can't speak with certainty why Travis, uh, chose to operate in that fashion he probably just thought it would be awkward to um tell destiny he didn't like his his style as he was talking to him and i guess he thought that he, it would have been more productive for him to say something after the fact uh than if he hadn't said anything um i wouldn't um i don't think uh like I, th I think Travis is really a nice guy. Travis is a friend of mine. He's he's given me a lot of um, given me a lot of you know good times on the Discord. Um, I just I just feel like if I had gone on his show and he asked me like, "What would you be doing if you weren't streaming?" and then I told him it might be music, right? And then after I went on his show, he like essentially told him, told his audience that I was too stupid for the kind of discussion he wanted to have. I wouldn't like that. Yeah, well, you know, I'm not exactly like I um I somewhat questioned uh I like the utility of Travis's um of Travis's motion, but well, I'm just wondering you know, because like he's I, a, he's, a, he's an independent entity, you know. I mean, like, I'm an independent entity too. Like I said, uh, you're not him. I was hoping to come in here and get him, but I'm glad to talk to you. Um, I also see somebody else. What's up, Ink? Is that Ink Pen? Uh, yes, sir. How's it going, man? Good. Um, did you kind of catch the drift of what I was talking about a second ago? Uh, sort of. All right. Um, maybe I'll re-explain myself because I'm trying to figure this out, right? <clears throat> I feel like if Travis came on my show and I just kind of asked him a bunch of sort of mundane questions that i had written down and then he just answered me in like three to five words or seven words or ten words because my questions weren't really you know conducive to answering and more than that and then after i had him on my show i did a video telling telling my audience that he was too dumb to come on my shows because he was like a debate bro or a new atheist or whatever like kind of label i want to put on him i feel like that would be like kind of unfair because my criticisms of him 
wouldn't have come out in my discussion with him. Instead, they came out in a discussion I was having with my community where uh, Travis wasn't there to respond to my criticisms. So is this, is this in reference to a specific event? Oh yeah, Destiny. I'm not even a big fan of Destiny. I think he's an asshole. I, I don't actually know Destiny. Oh, well, he was on, you, tra- he was um, on the Travis show. Like, I don't want to get like, like down into the details and stuff. Uh, we just kind of thought last week that the way that that was handled was sort of cowardly, you know? Oh, okay. Yeah, so on your channel, Echoplex Media, uh, you're, are you live right now or are you going to, is this no, going to No, I told to you, be- I told you that you were live on my channel because that's like the right and ethical thing to do. Like oh right well, just, I'm just I'm on your I'm on your channel right now, and it doesn't look like you're live. We're on Twitch. Oh, okay. Sorry, I went to YouTube. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we got kicked off of YouTube for making fun of anti-vaxxers. So. Oh really? I'm surprised they'd kick you off for that. Um, it's computer systems. They just catch keywords and stuff, you know. Oh right. And, no, and like it's their it's it's their website and it's their party. I don't want to get bogged down in that. I was just yeah. hoping to get a hold of either you know, uh, Travis or like, uh, like, uh, somebody who works on the project with him or something. Cause I, I really wanted to talk about that. Cause I mentioned that in the comments and I was like sort of challenged to come here into the discord at night and I'm here at night. And like, I don't, I don't know anything about either of you. Like I'm not here to try to argue with either of you or whatever, you know? Well, uh, I, I messaged Travis. Um, I don't know if he's actually awake or not. Um, perhaps not because he's not online right now, but, uh, yeah, I messaged him that there's someone here who'd like to talk to him. So if, if he is up, if he sees that, he'll probably get over here. I don't know. We've left a bit of a path of destruction in our wake. I'm not sure that Travis is really interested in talking to me. Um, no, I'm, I'm, no, I'm sure he'd be, I'm sure he'd be curious. He'd, he'd be interested in speaking to you. Maybe, maybe I like gave him our email address and like ways to contact him and stuff after he was like, Oh, come in my discord and talk to me about this. I was like, well, I'd really rather do this with video and stuff. And then I got no response from him. Uh, that's fine. I don't, I don't have any like quarrel with either of you. You're just part of a community. Maybe you've been misled. Uh, I don't, <laughs> I'm a lurker, dude. I just pop in sometimes and chat with people. Cool. Cool. I don't yeah. Know. I don't have a, I don't have Anything. a super, I don't have a super quarrel with either of you. Um, I don't even know. Either I, of you. I don't think that, um, I don't know. I, don't, I really don't think Travis is as bad of a guy as I feel like you've, you've had the impression of him as, um, my, my impression of that interaction was quite negative. <clears throat> I've had people on my show who I don't, who I don't agree with and don't like <clears throat> and i don't like ask them like what's your favorite color or some shit i know he didn't ask what his favorite color was but he asked him about music he's like oh, i'm looking at your philosophy of life on your website and then his video was like <clears throat> the definition of a debate bro is x and then he like threw debate bros under the bus and stuff and it was like well you know i i just i just feel like had he done that with steve during the show some someone with who I generally don't like with good rhetorical skills would have eaten Travis for lunch. Well, I think that, um, you know, just, just to come to the defense of my friend here, I think that his concern or why he felt like he was answering questions the way he was, um, or this is at least the, some of the impression that people had was that destiny seemed like he was more ready for a debate, which, and it, it was a debate that Travis, like, that's not what it was going to be. It was, just, I mean, if I were tra- like, to be honest, if I were Travis, I wouldn't debate Steve either. Yeah. Well, it wasn't go there. I don't think there was any intention for a debate, but destiny, I, I, I can't remember if this was Travis's impression or if this was just, because other people thought his, other people agreed with Travis. Um, they felt like he wasn't very engaged in the conversation. I, and, if I'm an interviewer, I feel like that's my fault. If my guest won't engage with me because I'm asking a list of questions that I had on a sheet of paper before the, the engagement and wasn't really like my, my take well, was that Travis had a list of questions and just went through them and wasn't really 
but that's neither here nor there. My my issue was that second video where he insulted his guest, but was unwilling to insult his guest in that way when his guest was there to respond. Yeah, I didn't. Um, yeah, I don't really see the necessity of Travis making that uh, video. But yeah, I, 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 well, I mean, I, I know why he did it. Because he's like a fake genius. Um, what do you? He's like Eric Weinstein. That? He's like a fake genius. That's why he did it. <clears throat> like, I think that he wanted to signal to you, his audience, that he's very smart and that destiny was not prepared for the kind of intellectual discussion that Travis was about to provide. I think that's why he did it. Um, well, I wouldn't really call myself Travis's audience so much mm. as I would call myself somebody who knows Travis. I mean, um, but there's people who hang out in my community. They're my audience, right? I, I can speak for myself. I've actually never seen any of his videos. Oh, I'm sorry. You cut out a little bit. So speaking for myself, I've actually never seen any of his videos. I got recommended this Discord through his, uh, like on my YouTube app, it just said. Oh, Ink Pen, I'd, I'd encourage you to watch his discussion with Steve Destiny and then the video he made after it. I don't really, like, follow YouTube intellectualism anyway. Oh, no, 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 but I would just, just like, for the, for the sake of, like, what we're talking about here, I would, I would suggest that, that it's, it, I think I'm right. <laughs> If you could imagine that, we all think we're right, but I think I'm right. Yeah, to be honest, I, I don't really, I don't really care that much. Or I, you I could watch my care. episode of the Intellectual Dollar Tree where I talk about it. Probably not going to watch either of those videos. I, that, no, that's fine. No, it's cool. Hey, uh, Reagan Ridley, what's up? Nope. All right. Yeah, Andy, I just. Yeah, you're not who I was here for. I'm I'm here for Travis, and I'm always here for Travis if Travis wants to talk to me. Oh yeah, I'm a. I'm sure that that won't be um that that won't be a problem. I'm sure he'll be when when he's on, he'll be he'll be ready to talk to you. Um, when he's not otherwise occupied with whatever it is he's up to. Well, I mean, yeah, cool. Yeah, I was just like sort of challenged by him and his audience in the YouTube comments to come into his Discord. And I have like a okay, lot well, less I, followers than he, his, he does, but my Discord's a bit more lively than his. Well, did he, would you really say that he challenged you or that he, he just specifically encouraged you did? Yes, actually, the video where he he uh the the follow-up video where he talked about his discussion with destin he specifically told me to come to his discord and talk talk to him about it yes is that a challenge or is that just an an encouragement to maybe have a civil discussion i mean i don't i don't know if i would be civil like i don't know i'm pretty nice but like i don't know i'd probably make fun of him I mean, there are rules here, like, mm. like not engaging in bad faith and, but what is bad? Like, what do you mean when you say bad faith? Well, like I would imagine that would be intentionally misrepresenting. Um, no, I don't intentionally misrepresent anyone. You said there are rules when I said I would make fun of him. Is it against the rules to make fun of Travis? I mean, no, but it's against the rules to repeated unhelpfulness is against the rules so if we were <laughs> having a serious man, I, have... <laughs> I bet travis if says we that were... he loves free speech too if we were having a serious discussion about something and all you were doing was making fun of the other person and it wasn't getting anywhere i'm pretty yeah i think that would be against the rules that would be considered repeated unhelpfulness but i'm yeah. no expert and here travis pangburn is uh, oh hey, travis. travis what's up How's it going? 
good uh before we before we start talking uh i'm live on my own twitch channel is, is that okay uh no we're in off air voice channels so so that's not okay yeah, if you read the, yeah if you read the rules not okay that's not okay well i i thought you wanted to talk to me but i guess you don't want to talk to me where it's been recorded what's that uh you had mentioned on on you know what Who you said you? it's not okay can to you, talk so we're done can you just you said it's not okay to talk, so we're done. Can you just tell me who you are? Like, I don't, I have no idea who you are. Like, am I supposed to know who you <laughs> but are? I thought you said it was not okay to talk while I'm streaming. Well, okay, yeah, you can leave because it's against the rules. We're in the off air voice that's, channels. That's, that, that, that's, I would not want to talk to me if I were you either. Why is that? Well, I'm streaming and I can't explain it, so. Let's jump up. Let's it's, jump it. up to the open discussion tab. Then, oh well, sure. then if in the open, can I stream in your open discussion tab? Yeah, yeah, sure. That's fucking weird. What the fuck difference does it make? What room we're in? All right, whatever. Weird nerd. I'll see you in open discussion. Uh, you sound like a retard. You're getting bad. <laughs> <laughs> fucking Travis Pangburn is a coward. Ah. 